When our fence has finally been finished, the thing looks so nice. The problem is it's so muddy at the minute. It's yuck. Let me show over here. There you go. Doesn't our fence look great? Welcome to our channel. If you're new here, please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. You can also follow us on social media through our Facebook page and our Twitter account, which is down below. Anyway, it's Monday. The boys have gone off to school. Some of us a bit, I don't know, he doesn't seem to be happy this morning going to school. I'm not too quite sure why. I think he hasn't been sleeping properly, to be honest with us. I don't know if he's just tired, I do not know. Anyway, Ben couldn't wait to get to school. He's off on the school trip tomorrow, bless him. So we're going to take him in tomorrow. But anyway, they're here to fix the fence this morning. Obviously, they should have done it last week, but couldn't do it because of the snow. So at least the snow's gone, so they can do it. And then hopefully, fingers crossed, we can go to the post office as well and see him comes home from work. And then once we've done that, um, we're going to try and change the living room around a bit, I think. Because Steve and um, Saying he can't, for what I say for his now, he can't watch the TV properly or something. I don't know, so we're going to give a bit of a change. So as you can see, they're here to fix the fence. The fence is down. It hasn't, to be honest with you, it hasn't taken them long actually. It's only taken about 15 20 minutes to put the fence down. And there's the old fence over there, you can see that there. So we're going to take that to the, break it down, take it to the tip properly one day in a week. Yep, so it'll be interesting to see how long it takes one to pull it up. You can see all the new fence posts are in. And that one there in the middle, just in the side, they have got to move that one. And then they're going to start putting yeah. in the new fence panels. The fruit of the snow is actually all melting, but the garden is a right bog now. It's disgusting. But anyway, show over here. The fence is coming on quite nicely now, look as you can see. Which is good. Look, look how messy it is over here. Yeah, we need some nice dry days now to dry the garden out. Yep, so there you go. The fence is coming on nice and neatly now. Really pleased with the well, fence. The guy who's here okay. fixing our fence, we're going to have a bit of a tidy up in here. Yeah. We're going to try and sort out some of the kids' toys, if they still want them or not. And then just have a bit more tidy up in the house, really, aren't we? Um, we decided when we was, I said we were going to change the living room around. We decided not to leave it for now because it's known where to put everything. We'll probably do it one day this week. We'll probably do it one day this week and stuff, so...
and finished. The thing looks so nice. The problem is it's so muddy at the minute. It's yuck. Let me show over here. There you go. Doesn't our fence look great? There you go. Our new fence. I know those two iron panels are slightly different because obviously we bought the panels originally because we were going to do the two broken ones and we decided to get it all done. So the problem is, you can see it's all a bit rather yucky over here. So I don't really want to grab mud in the house. Because well, so I think it looks really, really nice, doesn't it? The new fence. Obviously there's the old fence panels over there. We can say what, oh, and also the web things there. We can say what we'll probably do is break it all up, take it up to the tip or offer it for wood people want to burn it or something like that. So, like I said, this is our plan for the summer. Obviously when it gets a bit warmer, what you plan on doing was over here, see the tree stumps, we plan on see if we can cut them down to ground level and probably get a load of topsoil and just level it all off that way. Probably be a lot safer, I think. There's also for bear now and it's absolutely tipping down with rain. I don't know if I prefer rain or snow to be honest with you. Anyway, so I'm just going to get the boys, the boys a snack for coming home from school. Um, got a fruit sheet for him, and then Ben's got the orange one. And actually, for Ben, get him up when they eat natural bars. So I hope I have got one of these. I don't like these. I don't want Ben's season to be honest with you. And then obviously, Sammy has got his chocolate buttons. And then we find something from for tea also. Normally a meal plan, but because we've had snow, we didn't go shopping until yesterday. And then Ben's away from tomorrow till Friday. I thought it wasn't really worth meal plan, so to speak. Because I don't really need to check, for, obviously, for gluten and stuff. I don't know, I might find it in the freezer for tonight. This is something easy, hey, I think, for tea. It's got some post. What have you got in the sweet air? What have you got? Yeah, Popeyes and the Chessington. The Chessington Popeyes, yes. Yeah. And when are we off to you on sun Saturday? Chessington. If it doesn't snow well, again. Well, guys, another day has come to an end, hasn't it, Cheryl? It has. Yes, it's now the glory of the rain. Yes, raining outside. That garden is like a complete bog. Now, everything's thawed out and basically... Now the ground's fallen out, everything's so soggy, it's horrible, isn't it? It is. My mum will go out the garden for a while. Right, the first we had the fence put in is dug down as well, that's made it. Right, now the fence has been done out there and, uh, you know, it's made it even worse, especially along here. It's just like a complete mess. Oh, guys. Well, let's win the lottery, ain't eh? That'd be nice. Anyway. Tomorrow is Tuesday and uh, Ben goes off on his residential to York with his class tomorrow. So you won't be seeing Ben on the vlogs now until Friday. You'll probably see him tomorrow morning. Yeah, you'll probably see him tomorrow morning, but after that he won't be on till Friday until when he comes back because that's going to be a late one on Friday night coming back because they reckon they're not going to be back till half five, but I say six o'clock. So when they come back from York, yeah. is it the M1 that will come back from York? I think so, yeah. I think it's the M1, isn't it? Yeah. Um, I don't know what time they're leaving on Friday, do you? Mine's not leaving on Friday, though. Anyway, uh, apparently he's going to go and see a chocolate factory up there. Uh, and also going to go and see Train Museum, isn't it? Yeah, that's the um, Train Museum. That's where the um, rocket is. What else are they doing during the period of time? Anyway, we'll let you know what's going on probably Friday when, when he comes back. He'll be absolutely shattered though, bless him. Yeah, we'll dragging his butt to Chesterton on Saturday, so that'll be even more tiring. So. And then Sunday tonight, Sunday I think we'll have a rest. Oh, mate, maybe Sunday we'll go back to Warwick Castle and climb the stairs again. I think he'll be shattered, bless him. <laughs> anyway, what much more is there to say, but give us a like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, Facebook going across the bottom of the screen and uh, yeah guys see you in the morning for Tuesday see ya yeah. bye